The Burlington Players are back, and this time, they will be telling the classic tale of the barber on London's Fleet Street, Sweeney. Todd. It's a musical. Uh, oddly enough, this is the 40th anniversary of Sweeney Todd uh, from when it opened on uh, on Broadway. Audience members will be engaged while they watch dark and suspenseful moments throughout Sweeney Todd's journey through London. The, the story itself, I think, is pretty well known. Uh, Sweeney Todd is a, a barber who was uh, exiled and he comes back uh, to avenge his um, to avenge his his wife and. Uh, and, and daughter, and he uh, he does that by um, taking his vengeance out on the um, on the judge and the beetle, which is a which is his bailiff, uh, for what they uh, for what they did to him. I had a chance to speak with the actors and actresses about their experience with the Burlington Players. Well, I'm playing uh, Sweeney Todd, also the subtitled The Demon Barber of Fleet Street, who um, was a man unjustly accused of a crime because uh, the evil judge and his beetle were in love with my wife. So I get sent overseas and deported to Australia, come back in disguise, and hear a horrible fate that happened to my wife and daughter. So now the rest of the play is my kind of gradual moral decline as I'm trying to seek revenge. I play Mrs. Lovett. She is the owner of the pie shop. She's Sweeney's landlord. Um, and she's really the one who sort of comes up with the idea to uh, start putting the people into the pies. If you haven't seen Sweeney Todd, you are in for a treat. First and foremost, I hope they're entertained by it. Um, production we're doing is, um, it's, let me put it this way, it's not your grandma Sweeney Todd, <laughs> okay? Uh, we're doing a very, um, very edgy kind of Sweeney Todd, and if you think of the Broadway version, it's very, um, ours is a, what I would consider a non-traditional version of it. From the Park Playhouse, I'm Robert Paris for B News Weekly.